Thankfully, it's November, and Appalachian Wireless is offering the Samsung GS8 or the GS8 Plus for $100 off the regular price with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. The Floyd County Emergency and Rescue Squad was in the water at Dewey Lake Saturday testing a new tool. The agency is now the only emergency response organization in the world with a Chimera electric bodyboard. Captain Tim Cooley says he discovered the device while watching an episode of ABC's show, The Shark Tank. And while the board was marketed for recreation, he could see an immediate application for water rescue. What I needed was to be able to, to try to obtain a, a, some type of transport from one side of the river to the other um, without putting a swimmer in the water, basically. A couple of reasons. Tag a line across the river, whatever, which is the hardest thing to do uh, to, to get a, a, a tension diagonal line across or to get medical equipment or a PFD or something to someone that's stuck in a tree. We've done this before. The company failed to obtain funding on the show, but that didn't stop Cooley from contacting the creators to share his ideas on making the Chimera a better fit for first responders. So my two ideas were, I need a burst of power. I don't care if it runs two and a half hours. I don't need that because we're not going to play on it. Uh, I need quick bursts. I don't care if it runs an hour. Uh, I just need speed, fast, and I need my power when I call for it. The other thing was much like a four-wheel or a gasoline engine. If worse came to worst and uh, power was used uh, all up, I wanted a reserve of some kind, just kind of like a four-wheeler does with gasoline. The company went on to implement Cooley's ideas, and after Saturday's test, Cooley says he is sold on the Chimera's potential. After my test today and seeing some things in still water, I can see that my members need, they've got to uh, get used to it. It's, it's, you know, it's a new toy, so to speak. Uh, it's another tool in our, in our uh, toolbox that we can utilize. If, if I had a call for it today, I'd, I'd use uh, one of my members that uh, I've watched already today. I wouldn't hesitate to put it in. Next up is more training and a test in moving water. Reporting in Prestonsburg, I'm Ralph Davis for EKB News.